What's up you guys, Sunny here with GeekTools.net and welcome to this really quick video. Um, I've been just stress testing my brand new 15 inch MacBook Pro. This is a pretty high end version, uh, 8 gigabytes of memory, 7200 RPM, 500 GB hard drive, 2.2 gigahertz quad core processor, and a uh, high resolution display. So it's pretty high end, uh, not the best, but it's good enough. Now uh, I am running approximately a hundred or so applications, the full Creative Masters Collection suite of applications and all of uh, iWork and the iLife suite and also the uh, Office suite of applications and also a bunch of other uh, applications just to really stress out this computer and I just wanted to basically see how it's going to be performing even with such a heavy load and uh, basically the RAM and CPU usage. So up here I do have iStat menus running and saying that it's stable at 73 degrees which is very good. Uh, RAM usage is, I have 3 gigabytes free so that's not bad at all. And also the CPU usage is very minimal so that's fantastic. And uh, now you're going to ask me, you know, how does it operate even with these such stressful conditions? If I bring up Exo Expose, you can see it's still fairly smooth. There's not a huge lag. Um, I could also, uh, you know, everything works. I am, here's Dreamweaver, this is my website, uh, up right now, scrolling, perfectly fine, editing, you know, editing any of these buttons or whatever, it's perfectly, you know, smooth. There's barely any lag that I notice from the, uh, without these applications running and with these applications running. Um, I could open up Final Cut Pro uh, 10. You can see it still opens really fast. This is the first time I, I've opened this uh, since the computer started up and it's you can see it's doing everything really well and I'm really impressed even under such heavy loads. I'm going to try to type something and see if there's any lag. I bet there is because it usually does lag. No, nope, no lags. That's pretty impressive. Um, I'm actually going to copy and paste this and see if it works. Now you can see there's a slight lag. Uh, in the copy and paste process, but after a, after a little lag, uh, it should be all good. It's, you know, behaving pretty good. Uh, I just wanted to make this quick, quick video just to show you that the new MacBook Pros are powerful enough to handle pretty much anything you throw at it. I could even do a 3D render test right now, and I, I swear to God, it's gonna do it really well because the CPU isn't getting used at all. Um, what else can I show you? Uh, this is a this is a uh, drawing application. Let me just see if there's any lag. There is slight lag, I've noticed. Uh, without these applications open, it's perfectly smooth. Now there is a slight lag between the cursor and the uh, when it's actually drawing it. So, uh, very slight, very small things here and there, but overall it's very usable. Uh, I'm very impressed with this brand new 15 inch MacBook Pro. Videos, uh, I'll turn the volume down. Videos you know still play oh, hold on internet connection sucks uh, videos still play this is a uh, this is a well I can make it up go all the way to 720p but um, this is a 720p video performing you know just as it would without all these applications open so if you guys were wondering you know if you should buy the new MacBook Pros from the uh, previous generation definitely upgrade it is a huge difference the only problem I have is with the hard drive it's too slow for me um, I do need an SSD so I'm likely gonna grab myself a 512 gigabyte SSD likely put it in this machine maybe not I'll have a look but uh, yeah yeah there it is a um, hundred or so applications running on the brand new 15 inch i7 MacBook Pro I'll see you guys in my next video thanks for watching and have a great day Peace out. Woo.